Another big time break in at a celebrity's home. Burglars have hit the home of Lakers guard Nick Young. The thieves got away with almost a half million dollars in jewelry and some other valuables. It's the latest in a string of celebrity robberies. And KCAL 9's Cara Finstrom is outside Young's home in Tarzana. While LA Laker Nick Young scoring three pointers at the All Star competition in New Orleans, it appears crooks were at his Tarzana home scoring $500,000 worth of loot. Or maybe he has a silent alarm. I don't know. Margaret Abner lives next door. She didn't see or hear anything the weekend of February 18th when detectives believe someone got into the sprawling estate and made off with cash and jewelry. These top athletes have jewelry, let's face it, and they like to wear it when they can. Dodger Yasiel Puig, who's also known for sporting bling, just got hit by burglars, too. It happened last week when baseball fans knew Puig was in Arizona for spring training. The thieves got away with $170,000 worth of jewelry. Since January, burglars have gone after a celebrity hit list that includes one time Laker Derek Fisher, rap star Nicki Minaj, and singer Alanis Morissette. Yeah, this morning in Tarzana, Larry Sorrentino told us he isn't surprised his famous neighbor was burglarized. After all, in 2014, Young made headlines when thieves heisted $100,000 worth of stuff from a Studio City home, including some upscale easy sneakers. He's got a great shoe collection, um, and that might be a motive, but even before him, when. Uh, Selena was living here. They broke into her house. He's talking about Selena Gomez, who lived in the house before Young. Detectives say right now there's nothing connecting the burglary here to other recent celebrity heists. All the same, Abner says she's not looking to rub shoulders with her famous neighbors. I try to avoid celebrities. <laughs> Abner there has been living here since the 1950s. A couple of other interesting tidbits. TMZ is reporting that the burglars got away with Young's entire safe, just carried it out. And they say one of his doors was left open. Reporting here from Tarzana, Cara Finstrom, KKL 9 News.